yeah, so it almost just feels like the waiting game now for Newcastle United fans in terms of when Amanda Staveley's uh, Middle East-led consortium um, gets confirmed. And now there's been so many dates flying around when, when this might be and so many people claiming it'll happen in you know 48 hours, 72 hours. I've heard them all, but it will really boil down to um, the paperwork once that's completed and then however long it takes those funds to be transferred into Mike Ashley's bank account and then and only then um the announcement will be you know made as a joint announcement um from from all parties involved and realistically um as I say you look at these these sort of dates and time frames and and it, it almost feels like you know some people are having a punt uh, trying to, to to get in there first and, and be able to say uh, I told you it would happen on 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 this day, but re realistically, for me, I think once this gets announced, nobody will care where it came from, the the date, who who said it. It, it won't it won't matter. There's so much anticipation here now for people to 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 get this deal done, and the fans, as as we've seen on 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 social media, you know, to get on the cans. Uh, and, and celebrate what the hope is that is the dawn uh, of, of a whole new era at St James Park. So, um, as I say, wait and game, patience. Um, we've, we've been asked to be patient for for a long time, more more than just a, a few months. So, we will wait and see when that announcement exactly is. But with the Premier League coming towards the end of that owners' test, with the would be owners expecting um the green light um it would now you know be down to you know the funds how long it will take to, to get those across uh and then hopefully it can be uh it can be celebration time for the fans